Walk down Rainy Street on any given day and this is what you hear. A dozen apartment buildings under construction, most of them high rises. Is it better? Is it worse? I, I don't know. Ben Siegel, owner of Bangers Sausage House and Beer Garden, has been watching it all happen. I think that as a business owner to resist that um, is where you're going to find yourself in trouble. Longtime nightlife spots like Container Bar already closing their doors, with Reina announcing over the weekend that September 11th will be their last night. The bar posting on Facebook, we knew this was coming and that our days were numbered. Is it sad to see some of them go? Of course. Yeah, of course. I mean, a lot of those, you know, are, are more than bars, right? They're people that uh, that we've known, that we've known on the street, they're friends. The closure of bars and small businesses like this to make way for big residential high rises like this is a main reason why Austin Energy says they need more power capacity and they need it soon. There's only so much power that can be distributed from a particular substation into a particular area of town. What were one stories are now four story. I mean, that that absolutely leads to more energy demand. That's why the utility has been building the new Rainy Street substation, which is nearing completion ahead of schedule. The structural um, components are all there now. The transformers have been installed. It's it's ready uh, for electrification later this year. The design, the product of feedback from people here in this neighborhood. This substation is state of the art, top of the line, and is really going to help uh, keep the power flowing downtown. I guess it's a good thing, you know, that there's, you know, you're going to have the energy infrastructure behind all the growth that's happening. Siegel sees that growth as a positive. He founded the Rainy Business Coalition, working together with his neighbors to capitalize on it. There is that nostalgia factor of what it used to be. But I also recognize that we're heading into something new and exciting. He sees potential new markets from the construction workers here now to the thousands of residents who will soon call this area home. I believe Rainy Street will be the seventh densest district in the country. In the country, right? And so all of a sudden, if you're a bar or you're a restaurant or you're a small business that's in the middle of that density, um, we're in the business of selling stuff to people and that's a lot of people.